What's new in Havoc OS version 4.4 official build based on Android 11 running on the Xiaomi Poco F1? Hey peeps, what's up? Manchi here, back with another video. And in this video, I'm going to show you what is new in Havoc OS version 4.4 based on Android 11 running on the Xiaomi Poco F1. Do note this is the official build and the first change you will notice is that the security patch has been updated to April 2021. The kernel they are using is Silver Core version 8.8. .8. Kernel build is from April 22nd. SE Linux of course is set as enforcing. Do note I am running the vanilla build with Nix stock G apps on top so that I have access to pixel launcher and we can check if select works or not here it is select works screenshot also works without any issues while we are on the home screen let us press and hold on the empty space go into styles and wallpapers and then if you go into curated culture the first three wallpapers which you see are the new earth day wallpapers and for you to get those make sure you update all your applications from the google play store next up let us head over to the clock section and they have added three new clocks first one is divided lines second one is ducks and the third one is s funny and before i forget in case you want to learn how to install this rom have a look at the features of previous builds of havoc os for the poco f1 we do have separate videos for those which can be found in the description of this video next thing let us access our quick settings panel and here it is you can see they have added the brightness slider to the quick quick settings panel and if you expand it you do have the brightness slider at the bottom as well next thing they have added is the settings icon so tap on it it will take you to the settings however if you press and hold it is going to take you to configuration center or havoc os customizations section then they have also added data usage on the bottom left of your quick settings panel other than that they have also added the always on display quick settings tile and if you have a look at your status bar they have redesigned the vibrate icon and the wi-fi icon has activity indicators besides it it might be too small for you to see right now but they do exist and that is something which has been added with the latest build next thing let us head over to settings tap on network and internet tap on the wi-fi name scroll down go into wi-fi preferences you have a new option called turn off wi-fi automatically which means let us say you are at a coffee shop having coffee using their wi-fi you know you'll leave in 10 minutes want your wi-fi to be turned off after 10 minutes select 10 minutes over here and you should be good to go similarly they have added the same option for bluetooth as well so connected devices bluetooth timeout same option for bluetooth is also present next thing let us head over to configuration center and status bar they have added clock customization so now you can choose to auto hide the clock and you also have all the other options which you see on your screen right now then they have also added always on display scheduling so you can go into configuration center ambient display and tap on always on here it is enable always on and now you can schedule your always on as well so you have different options sunset to sunrise or you can use a custom time as well then they have also added hardware button customization so if you go into buttons and navigation you can now swap out the volume keys when the device is rotated moving over to notifications and if you go into heads up you now have a toggle to disable launching the application when tapping the heads up notification next thing you will find is if you go into sound and vibration and haptics and you now have custom ringtone vibration patterns and these are the oneplus style ringtone patterns moving over to display if you go into dark theme then you have the option of colors so we'll go into dark theme and let us say turn on now theme color bam here it is these are your different dark theme color options and you do have a clear theme called clear spring which is baked in with this new build of havoc os next up if you go into about phone 
and then if you tap on radio info you will get information about your radio signal strength and all the different options do note this is not your fm radio but your cell phone radio which in terms of smartphones is your signal strength and all the other details then they have added another option for app lock so let us go into settings security app locker enter your pin and here in you can choose the timeout when the application will be locked so you have different options lock it instantly 15 seconds or screen off and yes havoc os does come with ir face unlock and app lock is also baked in next thing we can check is whether hey google is working or not so there it is hey google works with the screen turned on let us turn the screen off and ask the lady hey google are you awake and as you can see hey google works with the screen turned off as well let me now unlock my device next up let us check for safety net so here it is i am using the latest build of magisk canary do note my device is not rooted let us try tapping check for safety net and as you can see safety net is passing without any issues if you go into the play store and then if you tap on the icon on top and now if you go into settings about you will see that play protect certification says device is certified this means you should be able to use your banking apps without any issues in terms of youtube media playback everything works absolutely fine live caption works picture in picture works of course for picture in picture to work either you need to be in a specific country or you need to buy youtube premium those are your only options next thing we are going to check for is whether portrait light feature is available or not so here it is google photos let me try to edit this picture of my favorite football star and initially you won't get the option for portrait light just go back edit it one more time wait for the loading bar to finish and once that is done you go into adjust bam here it is portrait light feature is present and it works without any issues let us check the app opening animations as well so here are the app opening animations on your screen right now no jitters no lags everything is super fast same thing applies for the recents as well and have a look at the google feed also while we are at it again no issues with the google feed either next thing let us try switching between a few applications here it is no jitters no lags everything is again pretty smooth the animations are smooth as well so all in all another great build of havoc os of course the version is 4.4 based on android 11 running on the xiaomi poco f1 and that will do it for this video Hope my video helped you. Likes, shares and subscribes are appreciated. Feedback and comment more than welcome. See you when I see you.